The Marvel Universe is filled with heroes with powers that are out of this world, but there's one hero that is less explored by comic book fans. We're talking about Marvel's very own One Punch Man, Iron Fist. If you think he's like any superhero who is all brawns and no brain, then you don't really know this fella. But don't worry, because in this episode, we're going to discuss everything there is about Iron Fist and his insane abilities. From explosive punches to interdimensional travel, we've got it all. Today's episode will help you know one of Marvel's characters in a truly marvelous way. Our goal is to give easy, lesser-known insight about him, so you always remain a step ahead in your nerd gang. Join us in this exciting exploration of one of the most underrated heroes ever. Are you ready? Let's do it. Before we go into our explanation, we have a very small request. If you like our content, please support us by subscribing to our channel. This is a small click for you, but for us, it means a lot. Thank you. Let's begin. Who is Iron Fist? Does he draw his power from a dragon? Daniel Rand was a businessman, Wendell Rand's only child who had roots in the mystical city of Kunlun, where his family rivalries and love stories shape his destiny. Daniel Rand's family quest to reach the mystical Kunlun took a tragic turn during the dangerous mountain expedition when his parents' lives were threatened. Meacham, who was their business partner, had betrayed them, leading to Daniel's father's deadly fall. Daniel was left alone on a ledge when his mother faced more challenges, including a wild wolf attack. Despite Meacham's offer to help, they rejected the traitor and attempted to navigate the dangerous journey on their own. Unfortunately, Daniel's mother sacrificed herself to protect him, marking an important moment in his early life. After being discovered by Kunlun's residents, Daniel was brought to the city and presented to UT. Daniel was unaware that once UT had planned to murder his parents. However, Daniel underwent intense martial arts training under Lai Kung, the Thunderer, and Master. It. At 16, he achieved major milestones including earning the crown of Fuisi by beating opponents in the challenge of the many and also defeating the mechanical being Shu Hu. Daniel's further training involved rigorous hand conditioning, slowly making his fists stronger, from hot sand to gravel and eventually rock. Danny Rand faced a dangerous challenge at 19 to become the immortal Iron Fist. He was tasked with slaying the dragon Shao Lao the Undying. He was a fire-breathing serpent guarding its heart. In the fierce battle, Rand imprinted the serpent's scar on his chest, eventually defeating it. By dipping his hand into the brazier with Shao Lao's molten heart, Rand gained mystical energy, earning the title Iron Fist. Despite his calm exterior, Rand's journey to obtain this power was a significant achievement that made him stand out. Is he the first Iron Fist? The story of Iron Fist centers around Danny Rand and his connection to a legacy of Iron Fist that was inherited from his father, Wendell Rand. This legacy was explored in the Netflix series Marvel's Iron Fist, which has roots in the mystical city of Kunlun, dating back centuries. Danny Rand isn't the first one to be the Iron Fist, but is recognized as the 66th warrior to carry the esteemed title. Danny simply continued a legacy that predates his existence. While the powers grant by the Iron Fist gave him unimaginable strength, abilities, and knowledge, there's a lesser known but crucial trade-off. These powers are temporary. Yes, you had that right. This leads the warrior to a significant decision about the future. They must choose whether to surrender the gift or face potential death at the age of 33 at the hands of the beast Shi Lin. The unique tradition of passing on powers set the Iron Fist apart in the Marvel Universe. Unlike many heroes who keep their abilities throughout their lives, beyond Beyond Danny Rand, other heroes have gained the Iron Fist power through creative stories and the multiverse. The Iron Fist legacy adds depth to the Marvel Universe, emphasizing the temporary nature of its powers and the challenging choices for those who inherit them. He can control the nervous system of his body. Iron Fist's ability to control his body is crucial, especially if you're a crime-fighting nightmare. This ability ensures he doesn't harm others and he can focus more on withstanding attack. With near-complete control over his nervous system, Iron Fist can completely numb himself to pain. Furthermore, he can also resist drugs or poison, manipulate slow bleeding, and can very well pass lie detector tests. This control requires intense and unhindered concentration 
One of the downsides of such a unique ability is that it's too challenging when battling it out with the supervillains. While Iron Fist's powers are almost unstoppable, they demand exact skill and hard work to harness effectively. His powers are not involuntary or mechanical. Instead, he needs to consciously control them. Although he has the potential for many unique achievements using this power, such as passing lie detector tests by manipulating his heartbeat, these abilities are not frequently used in combat situations due to the challenges of concentration. Iron Fist emerges from the balance between his almost boundless power and the focus needed to master them. While his controlled nervous system presents new possibilities, there surely are practical difficulties showing that there is a difference between theory and reality. Can he fuse his consciousness with others? Iron Fist possesses the ability to perform a mind meld. Yeah, I know that sounds a little too much for someone who can throw heavy punches. This allows him to temporarily merge his consciousness with another person. What exactly can this unique mental ability do for Iron Fist? Well, let me tell you. This unique power enables him to share knowledge, emotions, and even memories with others. I know what you're thinking. In a world, being a super smart, emotionally connected, and super cool punching machine can make every everyone else seem dull. Iron Fist's mind meld gives a solution, although it can be used to make new and interesting friends too. But let's just let him use it for world-saving purposes. Further, this power allows Iron Fist to make others a somewhat less badass extension of himself. In reality, the consciousness sharing ability is a remarkable power that lets Iron Fist connect with individuals on the deepest levels. Whether extending empathy to a villain or providing a superhero partner with critical information, the use of this power is nearly limitless. Each time he uses this ability in the comics, it adds an intellectually gripping dimension to his range of physical power. This one simply shows us the versatility of Iron Fist beyond his deadly combat skills. Is his body immune to magic? In the Marvel Universe, having immunity to magic is a significant advantage. It provides a defense against heroes and villains who are reliant on magical powers. Iron Fist's immunity to magic adds another element to the list of reasons why engaging in a fight with him is a bad idea, as if his bulldozer punches weren't enough reason already. While his immunity is now a regular part of Iron Fist's abilities, it wasn't always the case. He acquired this power when he traveled to another dimension with the eye of Agamotto. In this dimension, Iron Fist encounters his mentor, the Ancient One, who gifted him a new outfit with additional powers, including the newfound immunity to magic. This generous gift enhances Iron Fist's already deadly set of powers. Although his abilities originate from focusing chi and aren't inherently magic, they are closely connected to the mystical world within the Marvel Universe. Here, magic plays a significant role thanks to characters like Doctor Strange, a friend of Iron Fist. Does extreme temperature work on his body? Iron Fist possesses an extraordinary ability to adapt and endure extreme environmental conditions. Looks like he draws his inspiration from the monks in ancient monasteries, martial arts experts, and historical wizards. Much like David Blaine's impressive stunts, Danny Rand can sustain intense temperatures and challenging conditions that can easily break even the toughest of heroes. He does this by employing focus and meditation. Whether he faces scorching heat, freezing cold, Cold, or any other situation, like enduring the Fantastic Four reboot, Iron Fist's capability to surpass ordinary human limits shows the strength of his mental preparedness. This skill becomes particularly crucial when facing deadly villains in numerous locations with various environments, ranging from the Arctic lairs to sub-Saharan caves. Iron Fist's ability to sustain pain through sheer willpower and function at an optimum level helps him stay focused on the immediate challenges he faces. Can he locate the pressure point of any human? Iron Fist possesses the unique ability to locate and manipulate pressure points in the human body. This is a skill that allows him to disable, paralyze, severely injure, or even kill his opponents. This power can set apart any hero in times of need, but not everyone can use this technique with precision and effectiveness. This right here is some serious assassin level stuff. The concept of pressure points has always held a certain fascination among combatants. Perhaps Perhaps due to the idea of hidden, almost magic-like buttons that can influence people's physical state, Iron Fist takes this nifty skill to the next level by turning it into a superpower. What makes Iron Fist even more remarkable is his extensive knowledge of every imaginable pressure point. With this expertise, he can strategically freeze individuals in their tracks, render them disabled, cause some severe injuries, or deliver fatal blows. The versatility of this skill makes Iron Fist a deadly combatant with the ability to adapt 
to various situations. Notably, Iron Fist's mastery extends beyond regular humans to superhumans. He has successfully landed pressure point attacks on agile and super sense equipped heroes like Spider-Man. This shows the precision and speed with which Iron Fist can apply his pressure point manipulation, even in a fight. This solely makes it a truly outstanding factor of his superhero arsenal. Can he travel through dimensions? As a child, Danny Rand faced tragedy when his parents died during a trip to the mountains. He was rescued and brought to the city of Kunlun in a different dimension. Danny had to undergo intense training to become the immortal Iron Fist. Kunlun, this city, had the ability to move between dimensions and became a crucial part of Iron Fist's impressive powers. As opposed to heroes like Doctor Strange, Iron Fist stands out with his unique ability to fight without relying on a cape. Yes, I said it. You saw strange. Danny has a hidden power that sets him apart, his skills to travel between dimensions effortlessly. Iron Fist's ability to travel between dimensions is even more remarkable because he doesn't need ancient artifacts or complex technology. He achieves dimension hopping purely through his chi energy. By concentrating his energy, Iron Fist can create massive astral plane portals, establishing connections between nexus points and various dimensions. This power grants him the freedom to traverse the multiverse completely at will. Whether banishing someone to another dimension or exploring different realms, Iron Fist's control over dimensional travel is super impressive. I must say, it is an aspect of his superhero skills that doesn't get enough appreciation. Despite the incredible potential of this power, it often remains overlooked in discussions about Iron Fist, making it a hidden gem in his range of abilities. Does he lose his powers when he uses his Iron Fist? Iron Fist is one superhero who has some pretty realistic limitations to his powers. His powers are pretty rational and understandable, unlike someone like Omni-Man, who has practically no limitations on his strength, and yet, he gets beaten up black and blue at times. To unleash the power of the Iron Fist, Danny has to channel all his mental energy through his chi into his fist. However, this process is quite draining, just like Iron Man's repulses, that need to recharge from time to time time. This occasionally leaves him depowered due to mental and physical exhaustion. Such a situation arises when he exerts too much effort, making him less effective in combat. Although, this depletion is not a frequent occurrence. It takes a toll whenever it happens. It's not just during fights that he loses energy. Focusing his chief for various purposes can also significantly drain his powers. Thankfully, Danny is aware of how to manage his abilities, allowing him to maintain focus and energy in most situations. How powerful is his Iron Fist punch? Ah, finally. Iron Fist signature move, the Iron Fist punch. This single punch harnesses the power of his chi, drawn from the mystic serpent Shao Lao's heart. By concentrating the superhuman energy into his hand, Danny's fists become extraordinarily powerful and resistant to injury. Unlike a physical transformation, this technique involves a psychic channeling of concentrated natural energy. You see, he isn't just all muscle. In fact, he has the brain of a monk with a body of steel. With his iron fist, Danny can shatter wood, brick, and steel, shooting punches with exceptional explosive force without harming himself. Yeah, the last part is what makes him truly exceptional. His powerful force has proven effective against super durable superhumans like Colossus, breaking Scorpion's tail, destroying Thunderball's ball and chain, and even penetrating Chi Lin, an enemy that was unaffected by Luke Cage's punches. His iron fist can bring down a hammer helicopter carrier with one strike and derail a nuclear train. In the past, using the Iron Fist mentally drained Danny after prolonged use, but this is no longer the case. The technique showcases his mystery over Chi and the deadly power he wields with this mystical jab. Does he have the ability to absorb energy? It is true that Danny Rand has the ability to manipulate energy, but did you know that this ability extends beyond his own chi? Yeah, it allows him to harness external energy sources too. In the Marvel Universe, which is filled with super-powered villains, this skill becomes a significant tool. When confronted with energy-based attacks from his opponents, Rand can absorb large amounts of energy that have been shot at him without any negative effects. This power enables him to turn an enemy's attack 
into an advantage for himself. And here's the coolest part. After absorbing external energy, Rand can store it within himself. He then uses the stored energy to enhance his own attacks, replenish his power reserves, and maintain a deadly presence as an indestructible superhero. Iron Fist's ability to absorb external energy enhances both his defensive and offensive skills, making him super deadly in battles against villains who can manipulate energy. Does he have healing ability? Iron Fist is surely a chi manipulation expert. He is known for focusing his chi energy into his fist, granting him the famous Iron Fist power. However, this power has its limitations, especially when he's attacked. That's when Danny Rand's self-healing abilities kick in. Despite being known for his offensive powers, Iron Fist recognizes the importance of a strong defense. Using his immersive willpower, he summons his chi to heal himself, saving his own life after facing imminent death in various battles. This self-healing extends to purging poison and healing severe injuries, but it comes at a cost. A dangerous energy drain that leaves Iron Fist temporarily vulnerable right after performing these life-saving efforts. Unlike many superheroes who are focused on flashy battles, Iron Fist stands out by actively helping others too. Beyond healing himself, Danny Rand can project his chi outward to heal others. This unique power allows him to transfer some of his abundant energy resources to innocent bystanders or fellow superheroes, providing strength and healing abilities during difficult times. Marvelous Verdict In this journey of exploring the Iron Fist, we've journeyed through a range of powers we never thought about. From fusing his consciousness in others to surviving the toughest of conditions, Iron Fist proves to be a true Marvel warrior. The array of powers possessed by this guy is so diverse that he might just replace a few heroes altogether. Iron Fist is a prime example of creativity at its finest and without losing touch with reality. He isn't all about power and saving the world all by himself, but about legacy and and willingness to sacrifice. The impact of such a hero remains pretty intense on the audience for a long time to come. While you may have your own favorite power of the Iron Fist, I personally love his healing ability that doesn't just save him but others too. Hey, why don't you tell us your favorites in the comments? This episode was our attempt to uncover many such underrated heroes in the comic book universe and I'm pretty sure we have only just scratched the surface. We hope you enjoyed this one because we sure did. Until next time. And if you liked our content, don't forget to leave and like and subscribe to us if you haven't already. Have a good one and be safe. Thank you, everyone.